In this session, we're going to have a look at how you can add in additional topics to your project and then link them into a menu. So let's go back to the project we're working on. Click on that and in the project structure we can see that currently we have a menu topic but with three associated topics with it. However, I want to add in an additional topic in here. So to do that, I just select Actions at the top right, select Add New Topic, give it a name, so I'll call this, for example, Health and Safety for the section for onboarding. So we could just create that topic. And now it's showing it being down here. So at the moment it's not actually linked to anything. So what I now need to do is decide how to link this. Now you can link topics um, in many different ways that uh, from the simple straightforward menu branching here to um, more complex types, a type of branching uh, where we can have one topic leading to several others and so forth. But for now let's just go in and uh, link this into the main menu. So to do that I can just go into the menu topic, click on it and it will load up the GOMO editor here and it will show me the contents of that menu topic. So here we go. Currently, by default, it's just created this content block with two columns. And uh, in terms of um, adding to the menu, we can just be adding in assets, just dragging in uh, text, graphics, and so forth to make that uh, menu page more interesting. But for now, what we're concerned with is just creating another link here into the, uh, the new topic. So if I just click on the assets at the top left, and this time what we're looking for is a menu button. Now this is very similar to a standard button, but just has a couple more features for use with menus. So what I'm going to do is click and drag that over to the content box here. And the key thing here is that I want to link it to that new topic. So what I do here is on the right hand side for the menu button properties I can just now add an action so click add action and the action type is link to to the screen and here in the results column what this will do is show me all of the the topics that I have, but also the individual screen. So I could, if I wanted to, choose to jump straight in from this menu button to a certain screen within within a topic. But for now, I'm going to say I just want to start at the beginning of that topic. So I just select the title, so that's Health and Safety, and click on Update Actions. So that's now linked and what I can also do is just change the, the labeling that uh, I want to give that menu button a more meaningful name for when the learner looks at it. So I'll just call this one health and safety as well. Okay, so that uh, is now the title. And also, um, unlike a standard button here, I can also just put in an estimated time for how long the, you think the learner is likely to need to spend on this topic and that will then be displayed on the main menu. So that's adding in uh, a new topic and then linking it back to a menu using uh, a menu button asset.